While certainly many students in Northeast Wisconsin have already begun this year's school session. Yeah, summer vacation is finally ending for one area school district. Mold caused classes to fold for more than a week in Gillett, but that all ends Monday. And Laura Smith was back in Gillette today, shows us last minute preparations in this Fox 11 follow-up. Teachers at Gillett Elementary are scrambling to get their classrooms ready for the first day of school. Typically eight to nine hour days. All the teachers have been pretty anxious about getting in and getting everything done before our school start. Kindergarten teacher Debbie Riegel says it's hard work. Normally teachers have a couple of weeks to get organized, but they just began getting ready Tuesday. Now it's kind of all compacted into four days, so it's been a little more stressful. But necessary after mold caused by a humid summer was discovered in the building last month. Crews sealed off the school for cleaning, which would delay classes for elementary students and eventually the entire district when school officials decided a consistent schedule was best. Over the last several weeks, the affected carpeting has been cleaned rather than replaced. If you pull up the carpet, we would have spread those spore, spores everywhere. So the decision was made, we need to clean the carpet before you pull it up, so why pull it up? So um, we still have carpet in our building, but it has been cleaned and um, it is mold free. Principal Marjorie Muller says very few items needed to be thrown out, mostly area rugs went in the trash. While the cleaning process turned some classrooms upside down, others weren't as bad. My room was in pretty good shape, and so it was just a matter of putting things away and reorganizing what was already out. Parents say they enjoyed the extra time with their children, but had to make some adjustments due to the delayed start date. We had a have a babysitter come over another week and everything, but that's fine too. Other parents we spoke with say they're confident the mold is gone and it's okay for students to go back. I'm sure they would never let the kids come back in unless it was safe. Students had mixed reactions when asked about the upcoming first day of school. I wish it could go sooner. I wish there'd be more mold. Really? To, for another delay. But school officials say they'll be ready when the bell rings on Monday morning. In Gillette, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. District officials told us the estimated cleanup cost is expected to be around $100,000. Gillette schools have to make up seven days, and so the school year will be extended a few days and graduation delayed. The specific schedule changes are available through a link in the news link section on our website.